I did a Yoda from Star Wars. It was it was pretty cool. It, it took about eight eight to nine hours, but it was it was cool, yeah. All in full color. What's the longest session you've ever tattooed? Ooh, honestly I don't time myself. You know, if it takes me all day, it takes me twelve hours. Take it all day. Yeah. you say sensitive? Yes. You seem like the sensitive type, I think. I can be sensitive. Underneath it all. Underneath it all. I think you're a sweetheart. Underneath all this awesome man. All this manliness, you're a sweetheart. <laughs> yep. Tell me what you just did right now. What is it? Well, I'm still doing. Uh, it's his two sons' names. So, a lot of your script is very creative, I feel. Like this, all laid out and how you decide what's thicker and thinner and all this. How much creativity goes into doing a piece like this? Because they just tell you what they wanted to say, right? And you think of everything else? Yeah, at this point, I mean, they pretty much let me do what I want. I mean, they know what I do. And... But so I saw you do somebody's eyeball to like no sleep. Did you have to put a spoon underneath their eyelid to do that? No, I think that's a myth. I don't know if anyone actually does that. I just tattooed it right over the eyeball. Just right over the eyeball? First pair I ever did. <laughs> Holy crap, how nervous were you? Uh, I've been turning them down for like, I mean, three years. And I finally just was like, you know, I've, Tattooed every other spot, and uh, I mean, I went for it. And I'm here with the very aquatic Dino Dino Cook. <laughs> How are you? Very good. How are you? I'm fantastic. What are you working on? Uh, sea turtle. That I photographed in the Cayman Islands about a year ago. That's fantastic. Why do you like uh, water so much? I'm just, I'm, I'm a water guy, water man. I've been drawn to it since the day I was born. I've literally been in it since I was in diapers. That's uh, amazing. And it finally dawned on me to marry my two things together. Uh, I was already doing photorealism in tattooing and then uh, I thought you know uh, it's not a far stretch to uh, marry it with the uh, aquatic images and then, and then my clientele base got way cooler and my life got way better that is amazing and uh, I found my niche you know what you need to figure out what you got to figure out how to tattoo underwater ah. <laughs> that could be amazing I'm a Tattoo a shark? Yes! I actually have a tattooed shark in my house. Do you really? Yeah. One of my buddies. I don't condone it, but you ever seen the sharks in the jars? And, oh. and he pulled them all out and tattooed them. That's disgusting. <laughs> it is. It is. But you know, I was like, I don't condone it. I don't really like it, but I had to have one. <laughs> I thought, you know, this was meant to happen. That's amazing.
joining us. Next stop, 